Warning, this video is captured in Call of Duty Black Ops Combat Training Mode on the difficulty Recruit, which is the easiest. I am not claiming any skill whatsoever. I did this solely for fun, which I had a boatload throughout this game. And I completely understand if you want to click out this video. And if you're mad because you got misled, read the whole title first. It's got to say Black Ops, 300 kills, 6 death, parentheses, combat training mode. I just got to give that warning because there's a few ignorant people out there that take YouTube way too seriously. And I do it for fun. And there, I know I'm going to get hate on this. For some reason, I know it after I give that warning. And that's completely understandable. If I get the hate and somebody else doesn't, I can take it. My skin is thick. Well, I, I use Vaseline for men. It's actually pretty smooth if you ask me. But ask your girlfriend about that one. Zing! Looking at <laughs> Anyways, everyone, hello to some combat training mode. It is White Boy 7th Street here playing some Nuketown Team Deathmatch. And this is really, really fun. I'm going to show you the, the rules that I use in this game. But basically, it's 9v1 TDM Nuketown up to 300 kills on a... T oh, look at this. One, two. Oh, put that in a montage. <laughs> but I played 1v9 TDM on the map Nuketown with a time limit of 20 minutes or 30 minutes. I can't remember which one it is. And I'll show it at the end of the video. But this is kind of like zombies, but for for online multiplayer. It's one person versus nine. I, I wanted to take off the respawn delay, but I couldn't because I guess they watched the kill cams for some reason and I couldn't but basically what I'm doing is I'm just going to work on these computer players and it's so easy they do kill me a few times but for the most part I'm just running them down with the chopper gun and it gets kind of repetitive but it is really really fun I had a, a lot of fun doing this and wh why I wanted to post this is so just for like a warning because it looks really similar to the online version of it and for montages and gameplay sake I want to set some kind of rules so we you gotta put combat training in the video title or there's gotta be some kind of way to determine if it's combat training or online gameplay I don't know about the XP bar. I don't think there's an XP bar. I'm looking at the screen and I can't see one right now, but I'm not familiar with the online mode. Is there an XP bar online? But it looks so similar. I think people are going to get confused and tricked and hey, they're gonna, they got to get figured. <laughs> you know, they, they're going to get misled into videos that are they look good, but in all reality, they're not from online and that's what the Call of Duty community is about online gameplay and now that they have this new feature in it I'm a little scared that there's not gonna be fake videos out there but videos similar to this and if you if you're mad at me because I put 306 in a title do you do you honestly think that I can go 306 I don't even think Zerg Grizz and Sandy Ravages and Jesus's baby combined could go 306 no matter what situation it is so so yeah that that's what I wanted to point out really quick I just wanted to set some kind of guidelines for the community and I know I'm no nobody in the community to set guidelines but there should be something out there so at least put parentheses that it's combat training in the title somewhere so so we know that it's it's combat training and it's not online because if you're claiming it to be online, you gotta get bashed. You gotta get so bashed. You gotta, man, you gotta get it. So th this is just a fair warning out there, and yeah. So th I, I, <laughs> I had a lot of fun. I know I'm in the chopper gunner most of the time, but that's why I wanted to do it because I I don't play six v six game modes. There's 
not enough action for me because I mean on a on a map like Nuketown there's a lot of action but most of the other maps it's kind of it's kind of slow paced for me you know I like a kill every few seconds there's a few maps out there that are exclusively for 6v6 and I'm not familiar with the map name so I can't give you any examples but I know for for example in Call of Duty 4 there was Showdown which is a 6 six on 6 exclusive map which went down pretty much it, you know there's a lot of action in those maps but when you're talking about a map like Overgrown 6v6 it gets kind of slow paced for my playstyle and I don't like it so I'm not too familiar with the 6 on 6 maps but on Nuketown there's a lot of action but I don't get to experience it too much and I've seen some videos out there where people just mow down un unprepared and unsuspected victims from their chopper gunner and it's not fair it's not fair whatsoever they got nothing that they can do and that's what I'm doing in this video but I'm doing it to computer players and I don't know I just wanted to have fun switch it up do something different I played a lot of multiplayer probably played over a combined time of 20 hours of multiplayer so I wanted to get some nuketown computer AI combat training action and and you guys seem to really like the first one I did on veteran I don't do you do you want me to do more veteran one I just wanted to do one video like this I don't think I'll ever do this again unless there's some challenge out there when you you know just use the crossbow or something maybe I can implicate some kind of challenge on these like throwing knife only tomahawk uh, you know s something crazy like that but I think this is the last time I'm gonna play but if you do this once it's really fun I did it twice once to get a whole bunch of unlocks so I can unlock the chopper gunner and gunship and stuff and then and this was my second time or my third time playing it the first one I put it on YouTube and or no I, I played four times excuse me one before the YouTube video for practice the YouTube one this one to I mean the one to unlock stuff and and this one to just pull nubs and that was way too long to explain that I should have just said I played four times in total but after after the fourth time I don't want to play it anymore it's like pretty repetitive I was just mowing people down in chopper gunner which is fun but I just wanted to experience the new town spawn rape because when you play ground war you really don't get to experience it too much unless you're talking about jungle and my kill streak load, as you can see, is the sentry gun, gunship, chopper gunner, and I use the sentry gun over everything else because you really can't get hardline pro. And and uh, I I, I want to change my care packages because I, I did this before and I got some really weak care packages and I wasn't digging it. And I, I tried dogs, but the computer actually kills the dogs and. I like my air support and kill streaks to do the work for me, so I, I don't know. I just, I just want to switch it up, do something a little bit different. This is a new feature to the Call of Duty series, and I just wanted to to have fun with it. So if you're still watching and you're mad, I don't know why you're still watching. I told you to to leave a long time ago, and I don't think people will get that mad at me. I mean, there's a few you know ignorant people that you know might thumb down this video, but that's okay. You know, my videos get thumb down for no apparent reason really I don't know why so like some of my I think I think I post some okay like the 50 what was it 56 and 1 or 53 and 1 52 and 1 one of those videos I don't know why that got a few thumbs that got like 50 thumbs down for some reason I'm like okay you know I'm used to people talking shit about my voice and saying I look like a pedophile or meth head or you know whatever they got to say it's pretty funny it actually makes me laugh now and you know hate's nothing new to me I I kind of I'm starting to embrace it. it it's not natural but I'm, I'm starting to embrace it now and yeah I, I don't want to I don't want to stir any controversy with this I, I just feel like I got to defend myself because I know there's a few I know that I'm gonna get a lot of support from you guys I know you guys are gonna love this video some of you guys out there and there's gonna be a few bad apples to ruin the bunch and ruin the tree <laughs> I made up a saying a long time if you're a true white boy fan you guys know a few bad apples ruin the tree but I, I don't know I just want to you know make it if I get the hate and so I can make a, a you know someone with less subscribers and less known in the community if I can take their hate from them 
and so I don't get because some people don't have thick skin and it, it's hard when you when you're a YouTube commentator when you first start off people will talk shit no matter how good your videos are no matter how hard you try for these videos they're gonna talk shit there's always gonna be haters out there and it, it, you get used to it over time but when it first starts off you, it, it, it's pretty difficult I know a few commentators that that quit because the the hate that they got and you know I'll, I'll gladly absorb other people's hate if if I could be the example and right here I I don't know why I did that <laughs> I I had a few I thought I had a few more a few more chopper gunners and I could end this pretty quickly I was on a little kill streak right there uh oh triple freed freed I got this triple freed I freed three computers see if I don't I hope if the computers eventually take over and the uh, what, what's that movie trans not transformers terminator what what am I oh my mind went, I'm a I'm a loser that I didn't know the terminator I should have known that instantly I watched terminator 2 so many times oh wait I should have got a collateral but if the Skynet Terminator scenario ever plays out, I hope the computers are like this. So we have a chance. Well, we'll rape the computers if they're like this. But if they're a veteran, we're going to have a fight for our money. I hope it's like veteran. So we have a, a chance to save humanity. If it's like this, it's got to be too easy. It's got to be over really quick. But I'm going to issue guys a challenge right here, right now. If you're still watching this video, I appreciate it. But I have a challenge for you. Use these same settings, same rules, and get the highest KD that you can possibly get. I sent the bench at 300 to 6, which is a 50 KD. I'm challenging you to get above that with 300 kills. So I'll, I'll allow video responses to this video. If you can do that, I would gladly watch them and leave you some thumbs up and all that good stuff i would appreciate you guys showing some support and if you like this video if you're still watching i would appreciate a thumbs up and i will see you guys later i'm gonna go online i'm tired of killing computers i'll see you guys okay here i'm, I'm gonna show you all the settings that i use so so you're not confused this is the exact settings I use you can you know tinker with the settings do whatever you want really but just have fun that that's that's the point I want to get across in this video have fun with it stop taking YouTube so seriously guys it's all for fun and I'm having more fun than I ever had before in my YouTube career so thanks again for watching I'll see you guys in a little bit bye